hi guys it's me again gideon your favorite virtual assistant and welcome back to my youtube channel so guys in today's video i'll be showing you how to properly create an account with the tone wallet for you to be able to create an account with the tone wallet the first thing you need to do is to go to your mobile app store. If you are using an iPhone or an Android phone, you can go to your app store of your device. For me, I am currently making use of an Android phone at the moment, so I'll be going to my Play Store just like so. Once you are on your Play Store or your app store, you go to your search bar and you search for Thone Keeper. Once you search for Thone Keeper just like so, this interface comes up then you select or you install the application that says Thone Keeper Thone Wallet then you click on install just like so once you do that you wait for the application to download and install properly so guys once the application is installed completely you click on open just like so so once you click on open this interface comes up if you're new to the tone keeper you can click on create new wallet or if you have an existing tone keeper wallet before and you still remember your pass freeze you can click on import existing wallet this is how it looks like once you click on import existing wallet just like so an interface like so comes up so if you have an existing wallet before you can click on existing wallet and it will request you of your first eight pass phrase once imputed correctly you'll be able to recover your existing wallet if you're unable to remember your existing pass phrase please note that you will not be able to assess any of your assets which means they are completely gone if you are new to the tone keeper wallet you can click on create new wallet once you click on create new wallet it will request you of a new passcode then you can select four numbers which you can use to protect the wallet or your passphrase so we can select randomly four numbers just like so it will request you to re-enter the passcode ensure to enter it properly again once you do that it will verify the process and this interface will come up the next thing you do is to click on enable notifications once you do that this interface comes up immediately this is not the end for you to create a secured phone wallet the next thing you need to do to ensure that your wallet is secured and protected is to get your pass freeze how do you do that you click on settings just like so then you click on backup once you click on backup you click on backup manually once you do that this interface comes up ensure to read through the attention then you click on continue once you do that it will request you of the passcode you imputed while creating the new wallet so this is the passcode we used and then this interface comes up it says recovery freeze it is always advisable that you do not store any of your digital wallet recovery freeze electronically for example saving them on your phone or on whatsapp sending them as an email or sending them to a trusted friend or family's dm what it meant by backing up manually is for you to copy out this passphrase and keep it somewhere safe and secure so once you have successfully copied out this passphrase you can click on check backup once you do that it will randomly ask you for three of your recovery phrases as you can see on the screen it asks for five eight and 15 so when you were writing down your passphrase ensure that you write them down at the number or form on which they appear so the fifth code we had earlier was ugly just like so then the code at position eight is jelly and finally to verify or to check your backup 
you impute the last code that was requested and for this it requests for 15. Please note that it can randomly ask you codes from anywhere. It can ask you for first, fifth and third, eleventh, twelfth and first. At this point it is asking us for fifth, eighth and fifteenth. And the fifteenth code we had was ecology. So once you do that you click on done. And there you have it. You have successfully created and backed up your Tonekeeper wallet. For you to learn how to link your Tonekeeper wallet to your Hamster Combat Gaming for airdrop listing, you can click on the link in my description or the video I'll be posting at the end of this video for you to be able to learn how to properly connect your Hamster Combat Gaming to your Tonekeeper wallet for airdrop listing. This is for you to potentially convert your airdrops into cash. So guys, if you like this video so far, kindly give it a thumbs up and if you are new to my channel, ensure to hit the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification so that you can get updated each time I create amazing content just like so. I still remain your virtual assistant Gideon and see you in my next video.